Is in my bag again. I'm sending you right back home, young man. Oh, jeez. Strange dude. Talking to himself. Okay, maybe Mama's right, and I should never go outside. Or at least I think that's what she was trying to say. Uh, you're the one talking to yourself, Norma. <laughs> How do you know my name? Trust is what binds us. And what is the opposite of trust? Mistrust. It's fear. No, it's definitely mistrust. Fear. What's so special about this ride anyway? Have you been on all of them already? Not this one. It's been closed since before I was born. It's based on Dr. Love. You know, the show where Pauline would solve people's love lives with heart transplants? It was canceled after three episodes. <gasps> uh, Courtney, wanna help me solve a... What's that? Sorry, busy. Stuff. <laughs> Laters. Ugh. Remember, consuming outside food and drink is a big no-no. And if you see anything that seems just a little out of sorts, you know, anything suspicious or supernatural at all, well, <laughs> just keep it to yourself, darling. <laughs> this is not okay. starter tour or the slightly revised starter tour 2.0 which includes the customer service simulator haha <laughs> maybe you would like to lead the tour yourself <gasps> good morning everyone I'll be your guide Norma and in a moment we'll be boarding the monorail and what about you freckles what makes you think you'd be a good flesh vessel mm, flesh perfect let's go <laughs> <laughs> What? How did that happen? I took the staff line. Oh. If I don't eat anything in the next minute... I know. You'll eat me. Can I at least finish this chapter? Hey, Barney! Norma! Thanks for saving us at such short notice. No problem. How have they been? They ate loads of sugar, told ghost stories, and now they're pretending to be dinosaurs. Ha <laughs> There's no chance they're gonna sleep. Great. The only way to stop him is to kill the dog! Uh, that's not gonna happen. Or you find some other vessel for him to possess. But the first option is way more fun. Ugh. <laughs> what now? Uh, see ya. Yeah, fair enough. So, I think I gotta give Living here a shot, don't you? You don't need my permission. I just wouldn't want Courtney as a roommate. We'll be the best of friends! <laughs> Just don't touch my dead fly collection. Or my alive fly collection. Or my stamps. Okay. Oh. I can't believe Courtney betrayed us. I can absolutely believe Courtney betrayed us. And for Norma? A doll! Ugh. I appreciate the gesture. But do I look like somebody who plays with <gasps> the limited edition Y2K Millennium Bug Pauline? Woo Action! You love your family. You make sure they wear their seat belts and wash their food before they eat it. So why are you selfishly leaving them with nothing when you inevitably die? It could happen any day now and you haven't planned for it at all because you are a bad person who only thinks of yourself. Patrick, where are you? Patrick! It's exactly what it looks like. I'm the socially awkward one. Stop stealing my thing. Okay, meet me back here in 10 minutes. Unless we get eaten. Then make it 15. <sighs> ah. Ah. Not a bad way to start the day, Pugs. Morning. Wait, we have a bath? So My new contestants, I presume. We don't get many visitors from the neutral plane. Step right in. You know, I'm fine with this, but... 
Aha! Who? Yeah! The book! I think that might be a bit long for me, Courtney. I've only just finished that book Barney gave me about the overly insatiable caterpillar. I did not see that twist ending coming. Spell book, Pugsley. Uh, B O O. <laughs> Wake up, my patience. Dr. Reverend Harvard, you may be a doctor and a reverend and a world-famous tightrope walker, but I cannot let my feelings for you interfere with my job. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to perform emergency surgery on an astronaut who is also my ex-twin. Did, did Barney just straight up die? I can't believe it. Pass me the popcorn. Darn. Uh. I need to go. And leave me with all these kids? No way, Jose. No, Norma. That was my little brother. He cannot see me. Oh, no, he can. He took the blindfold off. Hey, buddy. Uh, you okay? Sensing a lot of big sweatpants energy coming off you today. Oh, finally. Huh? <laughs> I'm very unpleasant when I'm hungry. You're unpleasant all the time. That's my... So kind of you. Oh, please. It is my absolute pleasure. You are uh, such a delight. Courtney. Oh, uh, hello? Um, I guess we don't knock on this plane anymore. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, that's yeah. it. Back to the left a bit. I want to go. I don't think Barney would like that. He trusts Pugsley, and... <gasps> you guys don't trust me? No. I brought soup. Okay. Ugh. Huh? Oh, for crying out loud. You don't understand! Sir, if you're gonna do that again, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. But everyone else was doing it. They're actors? Well, that's just confusing. But why? You're a wizard, Pugsley. Wait, you knew her? Well, yeah. I do that employee initiation day for everyone, even the impersonators. Uh, do you remember the last thing Jennifer said to you? Sure. She said... Bye. Before that. Hmm. I've got to go now. Badia, can you rewind a little more? She said... Oh, hi. My name's Jennifer. Okay, so I didn't know her that well. I know Barney doesn't like it there, and I'm happy being with him, but I still feel... Restless? Like you're at a station where the train's never coming, but you can't help thinking that any second now it, it might show up? Yeah, exactly. What do you do about that? I don't know. You mind if I make a minor incision in your cornea? Barney! You're back! <gasps> Barney! 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 Huh? Barney! Barney! What are you guys <laughs> talking about? Huh? All right. Cool. When we get back, uh, remind me to call my therapist. I didn't do it, if that's what you're asking. We can't rule out any suspect. Oh, I'm hurt, Norma. I'm bleeding. The day we met you, you tried to sacrifice us to a demon king. But I've had so much character development since then. What is that? Who, who are they? Oh, you redecorated. Love the statement wall. No, Pugsley, that's the fourth wall. I got used to having roomies, okay? I hadn't met anybody else in this dump for a year. I started talking to myself, and man, I'm so rude. If you can defeat Sir Spheroid in battle, then you may have my daughter's hand. I am not a prize to be won, unless you're hot or rich. Oh, come on, Bugsley. You must have read some kind of spell we could use, like a, a teleport or, or distraction. I was practicing one spell, but I was saving it for Barney's birthday. Ah. Buddy. Happy birthday to Barney. Happy birthday to Barney. Happy birthday to Barney. Happy birthday to you. Do it. We go live to our Earth correspondent now. Well, uh, what are you seeing there, Gord? <laughs> I did it. I actually did it. Is it true they have floors for each sin there? Because I'm one depraved sinner indeed. You see, deep down inside, I'm envy.
Hey, why you be acting so foolish? Like just. Ow! 